New Kumi Creator Bead and Braider. Create the coolest braided bracelets and necklaces for you and your friends. We're gonna show you just how. Here's what's inside. One Kumi Creator Bead and Braid Machine with the purple machine arm, white and black thread spools, wrist and neck measurement tools, end sticker sheets, end caps, end clasps, friendship beads, pattern booklet, and an instruction sheet. Start by inserting the purple arm into the base. Flip the white tab up, and push the white arm down. Turn the handle clockwise until the blue posts and blue spool gaps line up. Great, you're ready to begin. Choose a bracelet pattern from the design sheet. Keep everything ready before you begin. And remember, use white spools for a bracelet. Black spools are for a necklace. With the string end facing out, insert the spool. Remember to follow the design sheet pattern. Remove the string from the groove and run it through the spool holder, through the purple hoop, and into the white string slot. Leave this much thread above the slot. Turn the spool to tighten the string. Now fill up the remaining spools following the design sheet pattern. All done! Great! Now push the white tab down. Let's spin! Spin quickly but steadily. When the red lines meet, stop. Peel a clasp sticker and wrap it tightly around the edge just below the white string slot. Measure your wrist with the guide and then the braid. Place another clasp sticker just below your wrist measurement. Now pull the white tab back and all the strings from the spools. Cut off the excess strings close to the stickers. Open an end clasp. Insert the braid in by twisting and wriggling. Place an end cap just below the sticker and pull the clasp to the end. From the other end, insert your favorite friendship bead. Now insert the braid into the other end. Again, you might have to twist and wiggle it a bit to get it in. Now for the end cap. And you're done. You can make matching ones for your besties. Choose a necklace pattern from the design sheet. Get everything ready before you begin. And remember, use black spools for a necklace. White spools are for bracelets. With the string end facing out, insert the spool. Remember to follow the design sheet pattern. Remove the string from the groove and run it through the spool holder, through the purple loop, and into the white string slot. Leave this much thread above the slot. Turn the spool to tighten the string. Now fill up the remaining spools following the design pattern. All done! Great! Now push the white tab down. Let's spin! Spin quickly but steadily. When the red lines meet, stop! Peel a clasp sticker and wrap it tightly around the edge, just below the white string slot. Lift the white tab and gently remove the braid from the white string slot. Now lower the white arm and push the white tab back down. Pull the braid back and slide it into the necklace groove on the white tab and into the necklace guide at the back. Continue to spin.
repeat this step until the first spool runs out of string. Now connect the two measuring guides by placing the asterisk on number five and measure your neck. Doing it in front of a mirror makes it easier. Wrap another clasp sticker tightly just below your neck measurement. Pull the braid out from the white string slot and all the strings from the spools. Cut off the excess strings close to the stickers. Open an end clasp. Insert the braid in by twisting and wriggling. Place an end cap just below the sticker. And pull the clasp to the end. From the other end, insert your favorite friendship bead. Now insert the braid into the other end. Again, you might have to twist and wiggle it a bit to get it in. Now for the end cap. And you're done. Go on, make matching ones for your bestie.